what's going on guys welcome back to tech PCs so I am upgrading my internet stuff so I'm going to be upgrading the router and well no modem and, uh, and this bitch router so what I did is I went down to my local provider and I told them hey I want the next generation of modem and Wi-Fi because I need up-to-date stuff and for some reason my other ones were no longer taking the driver updates so what I had to do was go and get new equipment but I just didn't want any equipment I wanted the new gen 2 or their wave 2 um, setup so without further ado we're gonna open them up and see what they look like and hopefully they have some type of appeal and hopefully they work good too. So let's uh, let's go. All right, we're gonna go ahead and open the box. That's what we see inside. Oh wow, are y'all serious? Look at this. It's square. Oh man, that ain't gonna fit how I had the other one designed. The other one I had designed fit up inside there, but this ain't gonna work now. So, well, at least this one has a U. Damn it. At least this one has a USB connector and you see the USB connector so it has all your basic stuff. Now one thing I do know about this new modem is that it will only work with a Cat6 internet cable. I don't know why but that's what they told me. So here's what the new router or uh, modem. This is the new modem. Good thing about this one is it has a lot of heat ventilation to let all that heat dissipate. The other ones were kind of squared and clogged and stuff so we're gonna set that there uh, what's this uh, more stuff power cable and computer line we don't need that though so moving on to the next box this should be the router that's in here so we're gonna open this up and this is a thank you note throw that away don't need that all right open it up <clears throat> well the good thing is, is it has the same decor as the other one. It has that that look to it. Can y'all see that? That kind of checkered pattern look. So this is the router. This is their new 5G router from Spectrum Internet. I have the Lightning, which is the fastest internet speed that they offer. I think it's 70 or 60 megabits per second something like that uh it's pretty fast though it allows me to you know do what i need to do so yeah not too much to this router it's very plain and basic it doesn't it only has only has two lines going to it so i can only run two so if i'm going to run more i need a switcher for it and it looks like this has hang holes on it right here so it'll allow me to hang it so we got oh my god are you serious so anytime you guys get a new Wi-Fi ordeal, like a new router or a new modem, they give you a new password with it. I'm not going to tell you what the last part of the password is, but it's small income. And then it has a couple numbers at the end of it. So for example, it's small income 889. Wow, I really don't like that. That's another thing. They highly suggest to you, do not change the password in it because it could be an issue, especially if you need some kind of tech support on the other end um, and they're trying to communicate with your modem or your router. Uh, they can't because you change the password in it and then that changes the firmware in it and allows it to not be able to access. So there it is, guys. There's my new modem and router so hopefully they work out they look like they got to do kind of futuristic sleek look to them um, kind of look like one of those trash can computers is what it looks like and then uh, this is the new router the one thing I like about this router is that it has a smaller footprint than my other one my other one was really awkward and it had a big base and it just it didn't sit right at least this one looks like it's going to sit right and you know have a proper have a proper mount to it and stuff so the new updated speeds of 5G so they're they're finally bringing the higher speeds in it um, so I gotta get this hooked up I gotta get the firmware updated you know do a couple other things and we'll go from there and hopefully it'll be up and running so I can edit this video and put it up on YouTube don't forget guys we are 
on Facebook we do have a Facebook business page and we have a Facebook group page make sure you guys check them out and join along subscribe uh, if you like the video give me a thumbs up and as always I appreciate you guys and you guys be cool and hopefully I can bring some better content to us starting with uh, you know this kind of stuff so anyway guys I'm out of here and this was my tour of my new equipment that I'm going to use to bring faster and more reliable speeds to you guys and so I can play my games faster gotta be able to play war robots and total arena and battlefield and all them good games at the fastest speed possible just got to make sure you guys subscribe if you're not already subscribed give me a like as I said before check us out on Facebook and if you have any comments or anything make sure to leave them down below in the thingamajigger so that way I'll see it and as always y'all be cool and till the next time <laughs>